Hello, Morning Mimosa viewers. This is the founder, Holly Sisa. And as you guys know, Morning Mimosas values human life, criminal justice, healing, and educating for the Black and minority communities with a note that we love everyone. Before I get this episode started, remember, 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 if you guys like amazing skincare products, please shop Immuno Soaps and Essentials. Guys, remember to use our code MM23 when you're shopping at immunosoaps.com. You guys can get 5% off a minimum purchase of $7. Guys, it's a really great benefit. Please use it. Once again, it's immunosoaps.com. Please use the code MM23 to get 5% off. Make sure that you purchase a minimum of $7 to get that 5% off. Okay? And another great, great thing I want to announce as well is if you guys love handmade goodies made with love, crocheted items, please shop Gamel's Crafts today. I absolutely adore the owner, Harley, and her mother and what they're doing. When they sent me my flower crown, like when I opened the package, I felt love. So please shop Gamel's crafts today if you mention morning mimosas when you go shop with them you'll get ten dollars off your full purchase so just think about that guys a full ten dollars off your complete purchase just make sure you mention morning mimosas head over to instagram to check out canal's crafts and go from there guys so today's episode is about my journey and how far I've come from the young lady who lost a child to this beautiful, successful 31-year-old woman with all the confidence in the world and can't nobody bring me down. Guys, your healing can definitely take place. Don't think that you can't have healing. Healing can definitely happen. You have to have the mindset to want to be healed. Let me tell you something. It was hard for me to get to this place of, I know I'm legit. I know I'm worth infinity and beyond. It took me a while to get here. But it's doable. And you guys can do it too. Like I mentioned at the beginning, I lost a child when I was 15. And I thought that I would never, you know, heal from that. I can earnestly say today that although I lost Jemiah all those years ago, she is one of my big motivators to keep going. She's one of the biggest reasons why I know I will be a successful detective. Guys, don't let circumstances stop you from being the greatest you. Please take the time to re-know yourself. Get to know what you like. And whatever you like, turn that into something that you can make money off of. I get so tired of hearing people, oh, I hate my job and blah, blah, blah. You have a choice. Remember what E40 said, everybody got choices. So you have a choice to become that better version of yourself. You just have to take the time to do so. And what I learned is listening. Listening is key to change. And the reason I say listening is because I had great people in my life telling me amazing things, but I was too hard-headed to listen until it finally clicked in my head that, hey, these people are here not to destroy me, but to see Holly be the better version of herself. Not even the better version, the best version of herself. And I thank those people for standing by me while I became the better version of Holly today. I want you guys to be encouraged. 
I don't want you guys to be discouraged. I want you guys to power forward. You guys can do this. Take it from me. I wouldn't come on here and tell you guys no nonsense because that's not what Morning Mimosa is and that's not what Holly Sisa is about. Please take the time for you. Do some self-care, do some self-evaluation. Take the time, and I'm gonna reiterate this, take the time to get to know you again. We all get so caught up in paying bills and trying to make it in the society that we forget the most important person, which is ourselves. So please, if you guys take anything from this episode, is that I want you to take care of you more. I, like I said, I get it, the stresses of life. I'm a mother of two. I work a job outside of the home. I go to school also and still do my podcast while I'm becoming a detective. So you can imagine my plate is, you know, probably stacked higher than a buffet. But just like many other Americans and people across the world, we are busy people. But that doesn't mean that we become so busy that we forget to take care of numero uno. Right? So please, take care of yourselves. Take time for you. If you need to take care of your mental health, go take care of your mental health. Don't let past stigmas stop you from a brighter horizon. Take time for you. Go get checkups. Go do that yoga session you've always wanted to do. Go do that salsa class that you saw on Eventbrite. Your girls have been wanting to take you to brunch, go to brunch. Time to take care of us as individuals. We have too much on our plates. And sometimes we need to, you know, slide, you know, some of those things off our plates so we have a lighter load. We only have one life, guys. Don't destroy your life over stress and trying to fit these society norms. Because sometimes society don't love us back, right? So who has to love us more than us? Us, right? So, please, for those who are listening to this today, please take away the key points. Take care of yourself. Give yourself the self-care. And if I did not mention this earlier, give yourself grace. Give yourself grace. We beat ourselves down way too often. And that, my friends, has got to stop. Let's learn to love ourselves more than the stress that we put on ourselves. You guys deserve that, right? You guys deserve to not be as stressed, right? So today, Let's start somewhere. Let's start by looking at that man and or woman in the mirror and saying today, I will make that change and do it effectively. Hey guys, this is the Morning Mimosa's founder, Holly Sisa. And as you guys know, Morning Mimosas values human life, criminal justice, healing, and educating for the Black and minority communities with a note that we love everyone. Until next time, 
Thank you so much for listening.